What's going on, family members? This your boy, Kali Yak, and first off, let me say welcome to the Animal Planet. You are now tuned in to the Sometimes NFT Gorilla page. So, I'm getting a lot of questions about these NFTs, and one of the bigger questions is, what are some of the usages of NFTs? We like to call that the utility feature. Um, but... NFTs are being used for a number of different things, from images to collectibles and other real-world assets. But the real potential of NFTs go way farther than digital artwork. NFTs now are being used to purchase digital land, actually like land ownership. And in the case of music artists, um, they're being used for music ownership, licensing, and publishing. In my case, however, I'm using them to sell T-shirts and hoodies, which allow the owners not only to have a physical, unique garment, but they also have some ownership rights to that particular design, which they can resell or transfer to someone else. Uh, I also have the Sometimes Gorilla Characters, which, as some of you know, or if you have been on my OpenSea account, they're just a collection of different funny characters that are one of one collections, meaning they're different in facial features and colors and expressions and even shapes a lot of times. Um, the sometimes gorilla characters are very popular right now, but what I've decided to try to branch it out into is the t-shirt world because again, that gives them something tangible. As far as the artwork, in a lot of these cases, you get a certificate of authenticity. You can also unlock different behind the scene features of me actually creating these designs. So there's a lot of utility for these and going forward, um, there should be even more. Those are just some of the basic ones that I'm dealing with at the moment. But as long as, like I said before, if you're selling anything, that can be made into an NFT. And the greatest asset for us is that you get residual ownership going forward if somebody sells that or the value increases with that particular asset. So for me, that's the buy-in right there. So to really simplify NFTs, it's simple, right? It's just a new way to sell whatever you're selling. But this time, when you transfer it or you sell it to somebody, they get a unique identification number, which is sort of like a receipt almost. You know what I mean? It identifies them as the unique owner because they have to buy it using cryptocurrencies. And that's another question people like to ask me. Well, how do you buy NFTs? As of right now, the only way that I know of buying NFTs on OpenSea is through Ethereum or Polygon, both of which you would need a cryptocurrency wallet. There's a bunch of different places you can go. You can go to Coinbase, you can go to MetaMask, you can go to Crypto.com, you can go to Binance. All these different exchanges have different wallets where you load money onto the account and then you use that account to purchase your assets in cryptocurrencies. With the exception of Voice. Voice.com allows you to purchase with cash, which I also have a small limited edition collection over there as well. But for the most part, everybody's using buying F NFTs using cryptocurrencies. And depending on what platform you're going to, they will detail which cryptocurrency that that particular platform is using. So I hope that clears it up a little bit about some of the usages and how you and how you can buy NFTs currently at the moment. I'm sure going forward, it's going to expand. It's going to change and it's probably going to be a lot more easier. But currently right now, you have to buy NFTs using cryptocurrencies and almost 90 percent of the cases that I've seen, like I said, with the exception of voice dot com. But I'm sure there's others. But. I haven't really dug too deep into those as of right now. Like I said, I'm giving you the dumbed down version or the rookie explanation of NFTs. So if there's any questions or something that I, you feel like I've missed or something that you may need a further explanation on, well, just get back to me, inbox me, drop it in the comments. 
and we'll get right to it. But make sure you do one thing. Make sure you just subscribe to this channel. All right? This is your boy, Kali Op. Welcome to the Hannibal Planet. Holla at your boy. Peace. <laughs>